chances are that many of the products you buy, from the shirt on your back to the toys your kids play with, are made in China. But in the Deep South, we found a unique twist to the often lopsided trade relationship. NBC's Tan Truong explains. In America's Georgia, you'll find southern staples like Vidalia onions, homegrown watermelon, and now southern-made chopsticks. Welcome to Georgia Chopsticks, a fledgling private American company cranking out a quintessential Asian utensil. Ever think you were going to make chopsticks? <laughs> I never thought I would make chopsticks. It's, it's pretty strange. Everybody asks, you know, chopsticks? They still think like this is a joke, uh, making chopsticks in the United States. No jokes here. The workers produce two million chopsticks a day. Operations are 24 hours, six days a week. Company president Jay Lee says he expects they'll be making 10 million chopsticks a day by the end of the year. I wish like I have like 36 hours per day. But you're that busy? Yes. Its biggest buyer is China, which annually consumes more than 50 billion chopsticks. Because of its ban on logging and a general shortage of trees, China is running low on wood and importing more of it. Apparently, the trees from this region of Georgia are practically perfect for making chopsticks. Poplar trees provide pliable wood that's resistant to splintering. With so many manufacturing jobs going overseas, there's a lot of pride in exporting to Asia. Very, very proud of that because there's not one thing in my house probably made in America. Everything's made everywhere else. Made in USA. I just told them, you know, box maker, make the biggest you can made in USA. They make the chopsticks, can but can they use them? We shall. I definitely use them, I guess. Can you use chopsticks? No. <laughs> I'm getting the feeling that you prefer a fork more than chopsticks. A fork or a spoon. My hands have got cramps. Oh, no. <laughs> well, they may not be happy with their technique, but these workers are grateful to have jobs in such a weak economy. That's about it. Chopsticks made in Georgia. It's American industrialism, Southern style. For today, Tan Trung, NBC News, America's Georgia.